What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I'm gonna hit you with a vlog today because we got a lot of good stuff going on. Right now it is 6.42 in the morning. My son is sleeping, that's why I'm talking like this. We're cooking up some bacon, some hard boiled eggs. Yeah, we're cooling them down in there. Maybe one day you guys will know the Mexican secret hard boiled eggs. But uh, yeah, let's get into the vlog. So we got a lot going on today. Of course, we gotta start it out with some Paper Street Coffee. Use code CXC to get 15% off, 20% off, something like that. It'll be in the show notes, or in the, the link will be in the YouTube description. But we have to go to the gym and work out. We have to go to the skate park because my son has a skateboarding lesson. I'm gonna skate a little bit. And then we have to move a bunch of stuff from the gym, dude. We're getting down to the wire. It's like a week and a half until we're out of that freaking place. I'm so pumped. Four hard boiled eggs there, plus some bacon, paper street coffee, water. This is true CrossFit. We're gonna eat, we're gonna try to get some carbs in too, and then we're gonna go to the gym in like 30, 45 minutes, something like that. Skate now, dude. You ready to go to skate park? Yeah, let's go. So currently we are, um, it's been a couple days since I've talked to the camera, but we are getting stuff in the shed and getting stuff in the garage. There goes Tristan. Hi. <laughs> but uh, we decided that our garage is actually gonna be our cardio zone. So we got that right there. We, uh, we have one of, the, one of the three Echo bikes here. This one is actually Tristan's. I brought his here because whatever. We have our Z-Bex thing out there, our runner. So you can see that. I'll show you guys the the shed real quick. I like vlogging has been so difficult to try to remember to do, but it's just because like the main focus is the podcast, obviously, right? So anyway, here's the garage or the shed. All right, dumbbell rack right there. We got pads, all of our bands, our yoke squat rack. Those um I just ordered. Okay, so rower. I just ordered two stands today for our skiers. I don't think they're gonna stay in here. One is for sure going in the garage. Two plow boxes, <laughs> other squat rack. Just hung that up today, the whiteboard. So yeah, it's starting to shape up, but uh, we got a lot more space in here than I thought, but also a little bit less space than I thought, if that makes sense. So 
Um, dumbbells won't come here until next weekend because I still have to service people at the gym. We're not officially closed. We have a week and a half until we're closed. But yeah, that's how we're looking now. I'll show you guys what it looks like when we're more set up. Stuff over there. What happened? What is all that? What are you that? yelling about? I'm not yelling. I'm just saying, what is that? And what is all Those that? are, I mean, those I'll take that to the other gym. <clears throat> that's my kickboxing gear and then some like hurdles and stuff. Don't worry about so that. Much Don't worry about that. Okay. All right. Heather actually took the liberty of cleaning the garage basically by herself today while I moved around stuff at the gym. You know how to fix the lighting? Looks good. So, wait. My dad came. At least there's one uh, handyman on deck. That's me. I'm the handyman. But you did hang this clock. I did. I did do that. And I'm the whiteboard, which I actually think is in the wrong spot. You should go over a little bit. Right? Why? I just think like. You guys, this vlog has taken place over like three different days. Yesterday we worked so much, we did so much stuff to clear out the gym, the shed, the garage, and then put the shed and garage together. I'm gonna show you all that in a minute, but I'm sitting here editing this vlog right now in the, uh, the sunroom office, is what we've been calling it, while listening to some acid jazz. One of my freaking clients who was born in like 2000, in the 2000s at least, like 2005 probably, I don't know. He's 18 now, so two, who cares what the math is? But anyway, he's got me obsessed with this freaking genre called acid jazz because it reminds me of back in the skateboard days and I'm going through a quarter life crisis where I want to skateboard again and stuff. Not really, I've always been in love with skateboarding, but now that my son is able to skateboard, I can actually justify going and skateboarding, doing something fun like that. Anyways, um, let's go check out the shed and the garage and show you guys the progress that we made in one day on that. All right, we are in the garage. It's cold outside and it's morning, so you know I'm accompanied by my mug with Paper Street Coffee in it. Use code CXC to get a discount on some coffee. Dude, I forgot about this. I put up a Sonos speaker right here for the mornings to work out out here and stuff. And uh, it's playing some, some freaking tunes, dude. So anyway, we got Heather's car in the garage right now. But then, off to the other side is the runner. The Echo, the skier, one of the skiers, I should say, and then one of our rowers. These mats, if anybody has any tips for this, they curled up. These are some mats. I have so many gym floor, like gym mats, horse stall mats, um, but these ones I got from a client, and this is when I was still having the gym. I got these from him, a client's parents, actually. And uh, they were rolled up and now they won't go down. So I'm thinking I'm just gonna use like Gorilla Tape or something like that to like keep them down, connect them. I don't really know how to get rid of that, but it's really ugly. And I don't wanna use the other mats because we have big plans for the driveway with the other mats. Let me take you to the shed. Here are the other mats that I speak of. There's a bunch of them there. Opening up the shed, which again, I would never give you guys the code to. Boom. All right, so we made a lot of progress in a day. Those agility things are blocking the three-tier dumbbell rack, but um, I wasn't. we didn't bring the dumbbells here yet. So we have two of the wall balls. We have a few more that we're gonna bring so that friends can come work out with us, but I just brought two for now so that we can work out here. A band thing, I don't even know what to call it, a band rack, and we have all the bands there. Two RPM boxes that we were gifted by RPM a while ago. This freaking yoke squat rack stand one of many fans a space heater the other ski erg a bar holder which i can't have the bars here yet because i still need them at the thing one of the many sandbags that we have um i still need that i still need the bars at the gym is what i meant to say put up the whiteboard another squat rack so yeah man a bunch of stuff this is gonna be a really fun space let's go back to the office so i can close out this video so what's actually pretty funny about the ski ergs in my opinion is that I just ordered two stands for the skiers either yesterday or Saturday. 
no, yesterday, but we decided to put the skiers up anyways because we need to use them, but they're gonna be put on stands regardless in like a day or two. So, so many new things are happening here. Um, I'm gonna show you guys in the next vlog the progress that we've made on the gym because I'm gonna vlog today, the gym. Um, we've made a ton of progress there. We plugged in our sauna. We have a little hangout room upstairs now for the kids and for anybody that's coming over because we brought home my couch from the gym. We have our home gym here, or our gym home as Colton Mertens and Allie would say. We have the studio, we have the office. We have, like, I just want this house to be like an absolute monster of a place for people to come, hang out, do work, kids. Like I just want to have everything here so we never have a need to leave. Not in a weird, like I don't wanna socialize and like, um, you know, wanna be a helicopter parent type of way, but like in a way that if we ever need to just be at home, we just be at home and we get everything done, right? And that the kids always want to like be here and have their friends here and stuff like that. I just, I really, I really, I really like how things are going right now, really love this. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you did like it, please remember to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new, and we'll talk to you in the next one that should be coming up soon. Peace out, goodbye. Shoot, one last thing. If you guys want to support us in any way possible, we really, really appreciate it. I'm not really trying to like push stuff that much, that's why I waited till the end of the vlog, but if you guys wouldn't mind going down to our description, I'm gonna put all of our affiliate links for Hair Strong Band, Paper Street Coffee, and Thirdsy. If you guys wouldn't mind, if that aligns with anything that you guys do or that you need, maybe just like click the link. Pick something up, it shows your support for us and it helps us get to our goals and what we're trying to do, do this full time, stuff like that. Um, yeah, and then subscribe because we are looking to get to a thousand subscribers soon and then uh, a thousand Instagram followers too, to be honest. So if you haven't followed us there, follow us there. We appreciate you guys so much. Thank you just in general for watching the videos. We'll talk to you guys in the next one. Peace out, goodbye.